IISC Bangalore, that's Indian Institute of Science Bangalore, is hiring chemical safety EHS officer. Yes, that's correct. So it's a great opportunity to work with IISC Bangalore and they are hiring the chemical engineering candidates for the post of EHS officer chemical safety. So let's see what are the eligibility criteria, what's the job descri description and the job responsibilities along with the salary which is provided for this job post. So the, the name of the post is EHS Officer Chemical Safety. The essential qualification which is needed for this particular post is three or four year bachelor's degree in science engineering or EHS safety. That means the candidates or you guys should have a three or four years of bachelor degree in science or engineering. Okay, next is the candidate should have a PG diploma in safety. That's a postgraduate diploma in safety from a recognized degree guaranteeing institution or body. Okay, so this criteria is relaxable for candidates with four year bachelor's degree or master's degree in chemistry, chemical engineering or related discipline. That means apart from three to four years of a bachelor degree in science and or engineering, you can have a four year of bachelor's degree or a master's degree in a chemistry or chemical engineering then you are eligible for this post, okay? So that was the essential qualification which is required for this post. Now next comes up the desired qualification or the desirable qualification for this post. So at most two years of experience in chemical safety and developing procedures for safe handling of chemicals in industry and acad academic institutions, regulatory body, or laboratory is required okay apart from that a master's degree or a higher degree in chemistry or chemical engineering or related discipline is desirable qualification for this post okay now let's move on to the job description what is the job description for the post of EHS officer so the EHS officer will be a part of the core safety management team at the Institute which will be headed by the Institute safety committee okay so you'll be the part of the core safety team of IISC okay next is you have to develop guidelines and procedures for disposal of chemical waste and waste treatment. Okay. Along with, you have to develop documents and implement chemical and journal EHS protocols at the Institute. Next is organize periodic trainings and enabling stakeholders to understand the principle and application of journal EHS issues. So that's the next JD which is required for this job. Okay, so you also have to carry out EHS inspections to assess conformity of various laboratories within the institute and assist in the development of centralized safety portal. Okay, centralized safety portal is their website, the IISC's website for the entire institute which would serve as a repository for safety education, training and documentation. Okay. Similarly, you have to develop guidelines for emergency preparedness and streamline emergency response. So this was the job description for the EHS safety officer post. Okay, now let's see what is the age limit for this post. So the age limit for this post is below 50 years as on the last date for receipt of the application. That means whatever the last date is for the receipt of the application the candidate should be below 50 years okay relaxation in age is applicable as per the GOI norms okay that's a government of India okay now what is the monthly salary you will be getting if you opt for this post or if you are selected for this post so the monthly salary is the expected range is rupees 28,000 to 56,000 per month. 
that means you will be getting rupees 28,000 to 50, 56,000 per month plus the 24% of HRA which depends on the qualification and experience. So your salary will be ranging in between 28 to 56 with 24% of HRA. Okay. Now that was the salary which you will be getting if you join this post or if you are selected for this post. Now the duration for this post is the engagement is purely temporary and it's a contract basis for a period of two years. Okay. Now how to apply for this post? So what you have to do is if you click on this, you have to fill the online form and then you have to submit this form on or before 8th of February 2022. Okay. That means if you open this form, it takes you to the Google Doc, okay, where you have to fill the form. Now, if you see here, it says you cannot respond to the application, right? So, in that case, what you have to do is the next step you have to follow. If there is a technical issue in submitting the form, you can email your CVs, okay, for the post. Like you have to mention the post as a subject, okay, chemical safety officer. And then you have to email your CVs to hiring.oleseh at the rate iisc.ac.in. Okay. So either if this form is, this link is working for you guys, you can send it, you can fill the application and just send your forms over there. Otherwise, you can just email your CVs to hiring.oleseh at the rate iisc dot ac dot in mentioning the subject as chemical safety officer okay the cv must contain photographs that means you sh your sh cv should have the photographs your detail education experience along with your date of birth address of communication okay now the shortlisted candidates will be informed through email about the date and time of the interview so if you are shortlisted further so you will be informed through email via email about the date and time of the further interview. Candidates are also advised to provide the correct information in their online application. That means if you are submitting the online application, make sure the each and every information is correct. Okay, your spelling or let's say your address proof or date of birth, each and every information should be correct. The electronic mode of the interview, interview that means Zoom call or Microsoft team will be intimated to the candidates in advance. That means if you are shortlisted for the further interview round, then you will be intimated by a Zoom call or a Microsoft team link, which will be sent to you by the IISC officials and they will be conducting the uh, interview by a Zoom call or a Microsoft team link. Okay, so that was how to apply for this job post. Now, the journal in instructions which you should keep in mind while you're applying for this post, that means the candidate must possess an essential prescribed qualification. That means you should meet the qualification criteria which is mentioned for this post. Okay, the qualifications other than one prescribed in advance advertisement will not be accepted. That means if you are applying Apart from the qualifications which are mentioned, your CV will be rejected, okay? The selected candidates must accept the offer within two weeks. If, if you're further selected, then you should select the offer letter for within two weeks of the formal letter, okay? Similarly, the candidates contract of candidates submitting false certificates or suppression submission of incorrect information shall be li liable to the termination or disqualification or rejection at any stage okay so these are the general instruction which you can see and which you can follow while you are applying for this post okay and at last the last date for this to or this job posting to apply is 8 february 2022 okay so all the best to you guys that's what it and uh, if you have want to you know check this uh, job posting so you can 
just go to www.resignica.com that's our website and inside that just land out to this page that is IISC Bangalore hiring EHS officer chemical safety okay so just land on to this page and then you can read out the whole notification and then apply for this particular post if you are eligible if you are meeting the eligibility criteria that's it and for any Further updates about this post or any chemistry or pharmaceutical science or chemical engineering post, you can just subscribe to our telegram that is Rasainika and Rasainika's telegram and you can subscribe the telegram and you can start the chat, you can ask your questions and you can stay updated with all the job posts. Thank you.